What's up, guys? It's David coming at you from Organic Prize Books uh, with a release of a new reprint of a uh, story or a book that's part of a collection that's uh, massive, that's huge. Uh, so right now we are looking at Sandman Overture, uh, the Absolute Edition. Uh, this is a reprint by DC. Let me show you that real quick. Here's the front. Spine. Uh, in the back of the slipcase. Let me show you underneath. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And here is this front. Now you, can you see that, that like embossed part right there? I'm gonna, there we go. Look, you see it right there? Very cool. The spine. Back. Now this is a reprint. This one does have the DC logo uh, right here at the bottom, as you see. Uh, I have the original one, I believe. Let me just grab it real quick. So this is my sealed, uh, I guess, I don't know if it's the first printing. I don't know what number printing this is, but this one has the Vertigo logo right there, as you see right here. Bam, bam. So this is the older one. Um, you know, it looks like it's, it's the same boxes together. Uh, new printing, older printing. Of course, the logo's there. You see that? And then the back. So it's it's almost the exact same. Uh, even the the book itself. Let's say if you put it inside. Uh, let me show you that. Yeah, except for for right there where you have the uh, the logos of the companies down at the bottom. Vertigo. So that's cool. Um, all right, let's go ahead and uh, take a look inside the book so that you can see what you're getting. All right, guys, let's jump into the universe of Sandman. Uh, overture. Let's see here. No, seriously, uh, I've said it before. I've said it again. Um, the absolutes are always, to me, my favorite format for comic books. Omnis are great if you want everything attached to it, all the little uh, side issues. But if you want, uh, you know, the best format for the actual story, the absolutes definitely take the cake. They take more time in making the covers and the the slip cases. Uh, they put attention to detail on that. Some of them are okay. Some of them are. are uh, truly exceptional. Some of them um, just, you know, uh, like this, for example, like I like the details. They put attention to details on that, the design that they did on here. Let me show it to you. I can show it like that. Maybe you know, like, yeah. See that? That's so cool. Man, they have some on the front too, on the top. Yeah, so that that is one of the reasons why I think absolutes are my favorite way to read books. They just kind of go above and beyond to give you a unique experience when reading books. Look at this. This is page. This page is like uh, it's it's paper, but it's like um, uh, patterned almost, and it's just basically for the cover of it. So that's that's really cool. Um, I'm also excited. You know, San, talking about Sandman is for the um, the mask set that's coming out. Look, are you ever gonna get this in an Omni? No. This is so cool. I'm gonna put it over here. I'm gonna slide it across. So look, you get to see this. I'm gonna put it right there. Whoa, so cool. You know, will you get that in an Omni? I doubt it, I doubt it. Look at that, that's cool. I am dream. Um, even this, look, so this is probably a spread by itself. I'm gonna just pull this this way so you can see it. Very cool, and it connects with the other one, but obviously you can't see that one, it's too big. Man, they really took the time to make this uh, really high quality uh, for Sandman. If you have the other ones, you probably already know this. Uh, the original uh, Overture has the ribbon, of course, to keep your place. But the color on this looks great. Look at the, the how, it, how vibrant it looks. The pages are huge, no numbers that I see of, but you know, you're not gonna need it with the bookmark, of course. Just look how uh, colorful and, and wonderfully um, drawn and designed this is. Man, absolute is the way to go, I'm sorry. I, I, I don't care uh, what you say, you know. I know we have the, the giant, giant uh, Sandman story, but if you want the entire collection, then definitely absolute is the way to go. I know we have, I think we have all of them available. Possibly, maybe. 
Uh, and you know, now with Overture, have you been missing that that uh, DC logo at the bottom? If you if you're particularly um, OCD about that, or you know, you want to make sure. Oh, look at that! That's so cool. Wow. If you're particular about that, th that the pages have to have the same logo, that's cool. I'm actually not too picky about it. If I were to have the collection, as long as I have all of them, that's that's you know would be my main focus. But some people like uh, uniformity, having the same. Again, another one like that. Oh, very cool. So this is almost the exact same as the first one, just different characters. So that's really cool. I like that. It's very interesting. I, I think uh, Sandman is definitely one of those universes that uh, have a lot of pull, not only in DC as well, but also like just the story uh, written by Neil Gaiman is, is, is expansive, you know? It's a real saga. So if you have read all of this, including Overture and uh, what is the other one? Death? There's another one. Um, I think it's, is it The Magician? The one with the boy, I know we have the omnibus of it where the boy is like learning magic and it's part of the Sandman universe as well. You know, do you compare it? Look, another one, another one. Boom, very cool. So this has a lot of pullouts. That's, that's really cool. And then it goes into the extras. So yeah, if you've been reading, if, if you're a big fan of Sandman, uh, let me know, you know what you thought of this story. If you have all of the collections, what format do you have it in? Um, and also, you know, are you excited for the next season of Sandman uh, from Netflix? Is it Netflix? No, it's not Netflix. Prime? Hulu? Max? Apple TV? Whoever is doing Sandman, yeah. Um, let me know what you guys think. I like the uh, the behind the scenes as well. So you get to enjoy some of the thought process on how, or look how they drew it, stuff like that. That's really cool. Very nice. And then, yeah, if you've been missing the DC or the, the Vertigo cover, let me know which one you have. Maybe you have all of the original Vertigo. Hey, listen, that's going to cost money. That's going to be worth it in the long run. But if you enjoy the story, make sure you read it. Let me know what you think. Uh, comment on the video uh, if you're going to buy this. Uh, check it out at Organic Price Books, guys. Let me know what you think. And I will see you in the next one.